Hey, I saw a post on social media that I thought I'd do a video response on. And somebody was asking, why do some DJs care so much about what other DJs are charging? It's an interesting question. And I am assuming a lot, even making this video, I'm assuming that the DJ who made the post isn't charging a lot and they may be getting grief from others because of this. I may be way off, but that's just an assumption I'm making given the tone of the post. If I'm off, forgive me, but that's what it sounds like. So if you don't charge a lot of money, why do other DJs get so weird about it? Why do they care that you don't charge a lot of money? It's none of their business, right? I can't speak for all the DJs out there, and I can't tell you why they don't like it. They might not even be able to tell you why they don't like it. Not everybody can articulate their feelings in a healthy way or sit down and reason it out in a healthy way. But I'll tell you why I take issue with it. I don't preach about it. I don't tell people what to charge. The only thing that I try to do is help people out with like a business plan where they're not paying to DJ. They think they're making money, but ultimately they're not. They're spending money to go out there and do someone's wedding. It's costing them more to do the wedding than they're getting back from it. That happens a lot. I see it a lot. And a lot of these folks, hey, they got a 40 hour a week job, or they won the lottery when they were 20 years old, or their family has money, or their spouse is supporting them, or something. Not the case with me, okay? I didn't win the lottery when I was 20. My family does not have money. This is what I do full time. I don't have that 40 hour a week job. I've put my 10,000 hours in. And this is the thing that I feel like that I'm best at out of all the things that I've done. Don't twist my words. I did not say I'm the best DJ. I said with my skill sets, music and DJing is probably the thing that I do best out of everything else that I do. It's what I do best. So it's how I make my money. And when someone out there charges some low arbitrary rate, like that doesn't make sense financially to reimburse them even for, you know, doing someone's event, it takes money out of my pocket. It makes it harder for me to make a living. It actually hurts the industry. It's insulting to the industry. And, and again, I'm not telling you what to charge. I'm not telling you you're a bad person. But ultimately, it hurts the DJ industry when you go out there and you charge these low rates. You know, they say people buy on price. Sometimes they do. When it comes to DJs, it's not like there's a regulatory board where it's like, okay, you rank as a one-star DJ or a five-star DJ or a ten-star DJ or you're a freshman DJ or a senior DJ or a PhD DJ. There's nothing out there that's recognized that, that rates us as far as how good we are, what our skill sets are. We're all just DJs, right? As far as public perception goes. And there are DJs out there who are really good at marketing and advertising, but maybe they're not fantastic DJs. They make good dough. On the flip side, there are some fantastic DJs out there that aren't very good salespeople. They're not good people people when it comes to selling their services. And they are bottom of the barrel price-wise. Whatever, do what you got to do, but just understand where the anger comes from, where the hostility comes from. When you charge a super low rate that doesn't make sense on paper, that doesn't make you money, it hurts all of us who are trying to do this for a living, who do it full time, who put everything into this, who do things like what I'm doing right now, trying to help everybody out there be better. Here I am trying to help you be better, and yet you're still charging the low rates. That's annoying to me. Do I keep it to myself? Most of the time, yes, I do. 
And we're all still friends, but if you're wondering why I have any business or someone like me has any business telling you you charge too little, maybe that's why. I actually have to profit from this or I don't eat and my family doesn't eat. It's kind of like that. I don't know how else to say it. And you may not like what I had to say. And you may think I'm picking on you. And if you feel that way, maybe you know you're not charging enough. Maybe you know that you're hurting the industry by doing what you're doing. That's it. Quick video for you. If you were wondering, here's one guy's explanation as to why. I can't speak for everybody. But that's why I care what other people charge. Yet, I'm not telling you what to charge. <laughs> I'm just trying to help. That's it. Still getting over my cold. I'm probably about 60%. I'm going to take it easy for the next day or so, and hopefully I'll be back to feeling more human. We'll see you next time. Practice and enjoy.